Hello, this is Robin. I am a very psychic person and I am an empath. Today, I do not know why, but the evil has amped up incredibly because the, the promise is coming in through the 888 portal and we have claimed it. Uh, we're going to have to keep claiming it, it looks like. This this flame reminds me that they're hot on, on uh, trying to prevent you from having what you want. I am here to protect you. I'm here to tell you these things. Stay in prayer. Stay in meditation. Stay speaking your mantras over yourself. The Lord will watch over your coming and going both now and forevermore. So stay in prayer. Stay in meditation. Stay with your higher power. Uh, whatever this is. It's pretty bad. Somebody's doing magician work. Look at this. We have a Gemini in the house. Hmm. What are they doing? Trying to tear down an emperor or keep him from seeing what he's supposed to be doing and not allow him to end something with them. They keep making little minor offers to this person that they've known for some time to try to lock them into space. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm seeing. So we have a Gemini messing with an Aries or a Taurus male, trying to prevent them from coming through. This is not, uh, not all Geminis. I love you, precious gems. This reading may or may not resonate for somebody, but it's just a quick uh, tap down into the energies that are out here and trying to prevent them from getting any progress. I'm calling on the Holy Spirit to intervene and to put a hedge of protection around the light workers, the healers, the earth angels, and the lovers, bringing them into the fruition of their blessing and blocking off this negativity and this evil. Take you, take it away, Father. I don't know what you have to do. Shut the mouth of the lions. As above, so below, everything in holy has to go. What's going on? Ten of cups, that's why, because you're happy. They're not happy that you're happy. Yeah, and you're about to get wealth. Yeah, and you might need to just be in your logical mind, paying attention to everything and your spirit. You might need to be that in order to continue getting your receiving your blessing. Even though Jesus loves you, you got to do the work. Okay, what else, please? My collective, just something happening, right? Yeah. They want you out. They, they don't want you to have this blessing. I'm trying to tell you. It could be a cancer. They're hiding something. Yeah, they're trying to keep it from you so that you can't see it. But you've already made your decision. And you're not going to put up with their shit. You're not going to let it bother your head. You're not going to let it bother you. You are not. Now, what's going to happen to them? They're the devil. Told you. What did I tell you? I friggin' knew it. Please don't underestimate my skills. God has put an anointing on me, and uh, it will last because I'm here until the very end. He's tried to kill me several times. Didn't work, did it? <laughs> the dark negative forces in this person are motivating them to try to steal from you or, from you or keep you from getting your blessing. You have to stay in your right mind and stay going forward. Yeah. What's going to happen to them? They're going to be put into a, uh, they're going to be in a pity party. That's going to all end for them. That's spiritual. Yeah. And this emperor is going to get what he's got coming. He's going to come in and bring justice to you. What else is? Yeah. He's going to bring justice into your environment because, honey, you're a friggin' star. You are somebody who's starseed. You're here to bring hope to the planet. You are here to bring God's word forth, to make sure that people live a righteous, upright way and do things the right way. And these people do things the wrong way. Wow. This, um, wow. What a wicked person. Yeah. See? And this may be somebody you know that was trying to uh, distribute their energy among two people or try to distribute funds. This is the Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune is working in your favor so you can enjoy your life. Finally, what's going to happen to them? Okay, this is a King of Cups as well involved in this. We have another person here, and they're, they're usually upright, but they have a hard heart. What else? Yeah, Five of Cups. Yep, 
they're feeling they're going to be if they're not already in this pain for trying to stop your your journey trying to interfere with your journey they're going to be so heavily burdened by this sorry i'm calling out the wicked ones today because i'm sick of their energy you're being temperate and patient you could be a sagittarian or a scorpio don't let it bother you see don't let it bother you sorry keep some things to yourself don't share it with the whole world Yep, you're going to bring down its towers coming down on these people because it's coming for you anyway. You're going to get the tower. It's coming for you anyway, babies. And you're going to be happy. Yeah. What's going to happen to them? They're going to be battling everybody around them. Everybody they got involved. There might be seven people. There's escort that cancer again. Why are cancers always subject... Why are they always the one that are subject of the witchcraft and the backstabbing and the evil eye and the jealousy? Tell me that. Why does cancer always have the finger pointed at them? Is it possible? Cancer and Sagittarius. Because you cut them off and then you won't talk to them. You don't, you block them. You don't, they want to come towards you. You block them. Leo. They think, yep, they, they think you're blocking their progress, but they're blocking your progress. Yep, and the tower is coming, and the gift is coming for you anyway. There it is again, same drawing. So, <laughs> wow, what do you need to know about your soul at this time? What do you need to know? Show me the, um, Isis, bring me in. Collective. If it doesn't relate, don't hate. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. If it does, please hit that like button so that others can hear this message. There has to be a reason why it came out. The scales of balance are here. So you, there's a scales of balance working for you. Um, and it's, it's divine feminine energy coming in for you. And you have the power over seven scorpions. You're being initiated into the magic of conjuring so as to have power to affect lower vibrational forces through your own will and spoken word. You are guided to use this powerful gift with compassion and discernment, with mercy and non-judgment. You can then manage any toxicity in your life swiftly and with great effect. And with that, God is our refuge and strength, our ever-present help in trouble. This is somebody who's a God-hater. They're a God hater. Why? Because they love their drama. They love to compete. They love to compare. They love to sneak around in the background. They love to send the evil eye and make somebody feel like they're not worthy. They 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 um they're they're lazy. They're very, very lazy, and that's why they're gonna go into damage. Um, they're sharing with many people, but they're not doing it with their sincere heart. Um, the Five of Cups is in pain, and they're going to be in sorrow for coming against a light worker, healer, lover. That is my story, and I'm sticking to it. Please hit the like button, subscribe if you like this, and tell me, tell me how you feel about this reading. It has something to do with your money. I knew it. I knew the bitches don't want you to get it. I knew it. Sorry about the language, but I don't care. I'm tired. I'm tired of these spiritual battles, and you say, oh, don't fight. Well, no, I always say send light to people, but <clears throat> that usually applies to those that you know, right? And then you put light around yourself to protect you from this shit because these people are just too much. They're too much for me to imagine. They're really something. Yeah. We have a Pisces in the situation as well. We have a distorted feminine. They can't get, they're never going to get what they, what you have. Yep. They're, they're not, they're not, uh, yeah. They're never going to get what you're getting. Yeah. This is somebody who walked away from you and broke a commitment. And you moved away to get your, your money and your peace. And uh, this person, whoa, they're in whoa. There's the six of cups in reverse. You won't go back anymore. Because they were a bitch. And they didn't listen. They didn't put in the work. They didn't want to make the relationship grow. They would, They didn't want to make you feel worthy. They've been trying to make you feel unworthy and steal from you. I know you know who. I know. 
I know you're going to hear this reading, whoever you are, and I know you're trying to do it to me. But you guess what? I am a prayerful person, and I am a psychic person. It's never going to work. I've learned to accept things that you could never accept. Thank you. Y'all, <clears throat> I just had to say that this morning. So, um, I'm just going to say, if this is your reading, you'll know this. If it's not, you may not want to uh, follow through. What does Michael say to you in this reading? You need to prioritize self-care net right now. That's the most important thing involved in this whole scenario. Spend time with your family. Build your family right now. Stay the course, Michael the Archangel says to you. Because you're a leader. And they don't want you to. They don't want you to help people out of their predicaments. You're at the resting tree and they said, God says, stand still. Say your prayer, trust, stand still. I got you. That's your message. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing, being here, and supporting. And also, don't forget to uh, join me on Patreon and support my work there. I give away three free readings a month regularly for years now. And also, I give away amazing gifts. And I don't know what I'm going to give away in September because I just had my meeting. But I love the way the divine inspires. That's important, right? And again, my motto, I am the darkness that is the light. I am the stillness that is the dancing. If you know what that is, reach out and let me know you know what that is. In the meantime, keep going, babies, because oh, they're not listening to you. They never will. All right? I hope this sets down well with somebody, and may you have a beautiful day. Clearing the energy and aligning back up with miracles. Expect miracles. Expect miracles, beloveds. Sometimes when I do that, it sounds like I can still hear it when it's done. All right. Thank you so much for being here. Just a quick drop in to show you guys that there is energy working, trying to work against you still. It's just that way. Just before you make your breakthrough, you go through amazing trials. I mean, um, difficult trials. Hold the course, stay the course, and believe. Okay? I love you. Namaste.